go. I got a few things happening to the Hilux, so I thought I'd just do a little video uh, and show you what I'm up to. Okay. Now, what I noticed, this is something that I've used. This is actually from Bunnings, and it's plastic, and I think it's a pretty good mesh size, personally. It's like a, a, a garden product, so if you go to Bunnings and you go in the garden section, you should be able to find it. I think it comes in a roll, and it's cheap. Um, but I think it's a good mesh size. You know, you go smaller than that, you know, you're going <clears> to... <throat> you know, it might get clogged up with too much stuff. If you go bigger than that, well, little rocks and stuff will get through. You might say, well, I don't... Yeah, as, as you know, you know, you, little rocks get thrown up on the tarmac, cars going the other way, cars in front of you, and if it goes through and hits your radiator where well, you start getting all those little dints and whatever, and um, so this is the standard Hilux grill off my N70. Look at the size of these holes. That's just straight through to your radiator, or uh, actually your um, air conditioning uh, condenser. So, I mean, they're massive holes, like the size of rock that could go through there. I think it's, and even these are still a pretty big hole. Uh, my Pajero actually had like a, a hardcore steel mesh, similar kind of size to this, um, built into the back of the, um, <clears throat> back of the grill. So I'm just doing an equivalent. So this will also uh, re reduce the amount of like grass seeds and stuff that gets into the radiator and um, you know locust plagues whatever um, unfortunately I, because I'd, I'd already cut this piece it's off a previous vehicle being reused and it was actually on that vehicle for a reasonable while and it still looks basically brand new uh, unfortunately I, before I had the idea of actually trimming it so that it fitted and I can actually use the existing screws to hold it on except I trimmed it a bit short before I had the idea and I'm going to miss that one but I'll still get this one so you've got numerous screws here and I figure I'll just find a gap in the mesh poke the screw through screw it on I haven't worked out the rest of this yet um, I just for kind of felt like showing you at this point so yeah, I think it'll end up pretty good. Ciao.